I did it. Oh my God. So I'm here on top of this big red rock to tell you about enhanced rock weathering and how it absorbs carbon dioxide from the air. Carbon removal is exactly what it sounds like. It's removing carbon dioxide that has already been emitted into the atmosphere, sucking it out of the air and storing it permanently. And it happens all the time through natural processes. Trees, soil, rocks, the ocean, they all absorb carbon dioxide and hold it for varying amounts of time. What's really cool though, is that now scientists are discovering lots of new ways to improve carbon removal processes, to absorb more carbon dioxide and to store it permanently. And one really interesting way to do carbon removal is through enhanced rock weathering. And that's why I'm sitting on a big rock here at Red Rocks to illustrate this because it's a natural process where it rains on the rocks, the rocks dissolve, they fall apart into little bits and those little bits absorb carbon dioxide. And scientists have just discovered that by choosing specific types of rock, they can absorb even more carbon dioxide by spreading crushed up olivine on farmers' fields. And then the farmers don't have to buy other products that they would normally have to spread on their fields and it helps the farmers and it helps the world.